Hello and welcome to Skyview News. I'm Chloe. And I'm Mackenzie. Our first segment is about the SWAT club. I wonder what they're about. Do you know like, what SWAT is? No, but I will soon. Greetings, and my name is Lily, and I'm here with Skyview News. Today we are interviewing Skyview staff and students about the SWAT team. Why did you say yes to joining SWAT? Uh, I said yes to joining SWAT because I wanted to help others be aware of the use and what they were does to you when you use tobacco and cigarettes. Um, I want to help others because in the future, like say you see them later on, you'll know that you help them reach that. Why do you think it's important to stop people from smoking? Uh, I think it's important to stop people from smoking because it ruins their lungs and their lives. What is the goal for this of uh, SWAT? The goal for this of SWAT is to persuade kids not to do drugs, not to do any of that stuff, vape or stuff like that. Um, we also try to like help kids. We also want to try to help uh, kids who like have already started that. We're trying to like help them not do it anymore. Last question: What have you done to bring awareness to the dangers of smoking and tobacco? Um, so we made announcements on the announcements at the end of the day, and we also have shirts and sweatshirts that say "Students Working in Tobacco," so people know like, that like they, they can have help. Okay. What does SWAT stand for? SWAT stands for Students Working Against Tobacco. Thank you. Why do you want to help others? I want to help others so then they don't get addicted to like drugs and cigarettes and vaping. Okay. Why do you think it is important to stop people from smoking? It's important to, just to stop people from smoking because they could get really addicted to it and then it will cause them to do other really bad stuff like drugs and alcohol and then they just can't continue. Thank you. Thank you for your time. First question, why did you say yes to joining SWAT? I said yes to joining SWAT because uh, I want to help people to stop smoking. Um, what is the goal slash purpose of SWAT? Um, it's to help people uh, try to stop smoking. And okay. Why do you think it is important to stop people from smoking? Well, I think it's important to help people from not stop smoking because it like, makes their lives like shorter or whatever. Okay. Thank you. What is the goal slash purpose of SWAT to keep people from doing tobacco? What have you done to bring awareness to the dangers of smoking tobacco? Um, we've put up posters and done broadcasts. Thank you. Thank you for your time. Wow, that was so interesting about all that information. Once again, I'm Lily with Skyview News. Back to you, Cleo and Mackenzie. That was an interesting interview. Yeah, I thought it was very intriguing. Next up, we have the baking show. I wonder what they're baking. We'll find out. Let's get into it. Hi, I'm AJ. I'm, I'm Bella. I'm Ariana. And they're going to be trying stuff. You can all try it sometime. Y'all should break it in half, which really, yeah. Me first? Yes. yes. Oh. Um, 
I like um, about the cookie that like is an Oreo cookie and um, the cup like the muffin or whatever like I don't know it's good they're both good um I like the crunchiness and the softness from the inside and then I love the raspberries from the muffin. Um, I like chocolate chips, and um, I like that Oreo, or the the muffin, or the. <laughs> Those cookies looked good. They sure did. Next, we have a battle. Wait, with who? It's Tupac versus Biggie. Who do you think will win? I don't know, but we'll find out soon. Hi, my name is Ilse, and I'm Jasmine with Sky News. Today, we will be asking people whether they like Tupac better or Biggie better. About Tupac. Tupac and Biggie were friends before they started hating each other. Tupac is older with Mrs. Beard. And Miss Beard, do you prefer Biggie or Tupac? Obviously Tupac. Why? Well, not only was he the greatest rapper of all time, he was a poet. He was very involved in his com community and improving it and making things better. What's your favorite song from Tupac? Um I really like the whole Machiavelli album, but probably Hail Mary. Hi, I'm here with... Tyler. Tyler, who do you prefer, Biggie or Tupac? Tupac, by far. Why? His music's better. His, yeah, his music's better, way better. Um, what's his favorite your, song? Yeah. My favorite song is Unconditional Love by Tupac. That's what's up? Yeah. I like that too? Yeah. See? Yeah, thank you. Christian. And Christian, do you prefer Biggie or Tupac? Tupac. Why? Because yeah, it's cooler. <laughs> What's your favorite song by Tupac? Uh, California Love. I'm here with? Aaron. And? Rashad. Guys, who do you prefer better, Tupac or Biggie? Tupac! Tupac! Tupac. And what is the reason? Because Tupac is just, Tupac is an inspiration to all the old people out there. Not the old people, but my mother and my father, which are old, because they're like 40. What's your reason? Because he made California live. And what is your guys' favorite song by him? Patient Me Roll. California Love. That's what's up. Type, type, type. I love California Love, guys. That's one of my favorite songs. That's him. Hi, I'm here with Miss Holt. And tell me, Miss Holt, who do you prefer, Biggie or Tupac? Um, I actually love both rappers, however, um, I really have to go with Tupac. I like that. Um, and why? Um, so for me, like Tupac was just super influential. He was actually a very educated guy. Um, he went to university. He was very, very educated. He was a poet. It's pretty cool. Um, but his music just really speaks to me. And um, if you had to choose a song that you liked the most from Tupac, which one would it be? I love all of his music, however, I think Dear Mama was like one of my favorites because like he had just this super like connection with his mom and I, like, I have a really close relationship with my mom so like it really spoke to me and it meant a lot to me. That's nice, I like it and same with the song, I like the song and it's very influential. But anyways, thank you. Thank you! <laughs> about Biggie. He died March 9th, 1997. Biggie's real name was Christopher Wallens. He died at 24 years old. Biggie had one daughter named Tiana Wallens. Once again, I'm Elsa and I'm Jasmine with Sky Blue News. Thank you for watching. Back to you, Chloe and Mackenzie. That was a great segment. It was. I'm on the edge of my seat. I think it's time for a commercial. What? Why? Commercials suck. Not this one. This one's magic. Really? Awesome. This pen can disappear anything with just a clip. Look, and now it's gone. This pen is amazing. You can use it for everyday activity. This pen is so great you can even delete your worst ass. She's gone, just like magic. So great you can even delete the school. Wait, no, Keely, you can't delete the school. Wait, why? Because there's people in the school. You'll get rid of everyone in the school. Okay, fine. Just cut that clip out. Cut that clip out. Okay, well, maybe you can't delete everything, I guess. And now we'll cut to one of our happiest buyers. Pen is the best pen in the whole wide world. It's not just an ordinary pen. It doesn't even write, but that's okay. 
When you point it at an item, it just disappears. It's so perfect that I can clean up my dog's poop with this pen. I can literally point it at the poop, go like this, and then the poop disappears. Or if my rival is sitting right there and I want their homework to disappear so they get an F, I can click their homework and it will disappear. It's so useful. You need to buy this pen now. It's so great. Even Mr. Huggins likes it. Just this look. is the best pen ever. It makes messes disappear like crazy. It's so good. Call 778-330-2389 today to get 1% off, which is basically nothing. Okay, I'll admit that was a very good commercial. See, I told you. Moving on from that, we have a game show next. About what? It's a game show called The Olympics. Let's watch. My name is Gabe Noble and I'm here with Skyview News. Today, we're going to be doing a contest between Easton Walker and Araya Johnson. Let's go. Our first segment is on a race. And this next one is a throwing competition. is a push-up contest. So let's go. Down, down. Up. Up. Down. 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 Up. Here are our winners. First place and second place. They both did a really great job. Here is the reward for being in first place and second place. You, sir, get three. You get two. Thank you. That was a very interesting game show. Yes, but unfortunately, it was the last segment. All those segments were great. And that's it for Skyview News. I'm Chloe. And I'm Mackenzie. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching.